Shalom to the nation of Israel. Before we get started, all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukhahak Badash. Double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth. To the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlikened to a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men, peace, blessings, salutations, and to the remnant, men, women, children, shalom, right? <laughs> you see this? Let's wa watch this. Let's watch this. L look at this article, man. This your brother Shapai, man. So, look, look. So, check this out. Banks are collapsing. Are we headed toward the new era? Era of C CBDC? I was watching the, the, the brothers, um, the elder out of Boston. He was speaking. GMS Boston. And he was saying that. He, you know what we all been saying. I just was watching that that, that um camp today, and he was saying that the only way they could bring in the digital the the digital currency is to to, to do this. They gonna have to do this. They gonna have to. They gonna have to do it. They gonna have to do this, man. They gonna have to collapse the banks, man, and consolidate them. And then, but watch what this say. The news of banks collapsing. The news of banks collapsing and emergency meeting. Excuse me, Salaki. Emergency meetings being held by central banks have raised concerns. Whoop de whoop whoop whoop. We know about that. So what is happening in the banking industry? Are we headed towards headed towards a new era in central banking, digital currencies, CBDC? Digital banking, digital currency. That's what it, it, it stands for. Are digital versions of a country's currency that are issued and backed by the central bank. They are not the same as cryptocurrencies like Bitcoin or you. So they're going to be different. So if you're holding on to Bitcoin, Bitcoin is going to crash, man. They're going to crash Bitcoin too. They're not going to just crash the banks. They're going to crash Bitcoin too, and they're going to make everybody start over. They're not going to let you keep your wealth from on this side. On this side, you want to give it all up. It's going to be totaled. It's going to be zeroed out. And then they're going to be offering their form of the um, digital currency, which are decentralized and not backed by any central authority. See? Now watch. Watch what it say. CBCs could bring several benefits. Remember how they're going to spin it to you as it's a good thing for you. CBCs could bring several benefits such as reducing the cost of printing and distributing physical currency and increasing financial inclusion. However, they also pose several risks such as the potential for increased cyber attacks and the possibility of a loss of privacy, huh? Despite the risk, several countries are already experimenting with the CBDCs. China is leading the way with this digital yuan already being tested, being tested, woo, 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 woo. other countries, boom, 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 boom. Now watch this. But what are the risks when it comes to CBDCs? The government controls... Lack of financial privacy, CBDCs, and all transactions will be recorded and tracked, leaving no room for financial privacy. The government controls lack of financial privacy, CBDC, and all transactions will be recorded and tracked, leaving no room for financial privacy. This means that the government will be able to monitor and control individuals' financial behavior, which could be used to target individuals for political, social, or economic reasons. They're going to have a social credit score. Vulnerability to cyber attacks, whoop de whoop 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 right? Vulnerability to cyber attacks. Okay, cool. Look, the possibility of... um. 
of the centralized CBD have the potential to be centralized, which means that the government would have complete control over the currency. This could lead to a lack of transparency and accountability, which could have serious consequences for individuals' financial freedom. Risks of inflation, CBCDs, could be used as a tool for the government to print more money. Yeah, we just hit the debt ceiling. We just hit the debt ceiling. So, by revamping or crashing the old system and coming out with the new one, they'll be able to go and start doing, printing whatever they want because it's all on the computer now. It will be no need for any physical money. ATMs will pretty much be a thing of the past, and everything will be tracked by them. This would reduce the value of people's savings, huh? This would reduce the value of people's savings and could have a severe economic consequences for the government. They don't care. They don't care. Dependency on the government CBC, C, CBDCs will make individuals dependent on the government for their financial transactions, which could, because they coming out in um, July, they coming out with the federal payment system, which could have serious consequences if the government were to become corrupt or oppressive. You think? Become? They already are. Reduction in the financial innovation of CBC DCs could lead to the reduction in financial innovation since they are controlled by the government. Yeah, you won't be. Ain't no more hustling. Ain't no more hustling. No more. Ain't no more hustling. Paying somebody off the books. All of that stuff is a thing of the past. Yeah, but I just wanted this move by the government to control people's money in an attempt to protect their privileged position and exert more control over individuals. Yeah, but people don't see it coming. People don't see it coming. They think Esau got their best interests at heart. That, they, you know, that paper, like I said, my, my, my sister was having a conversation with, with a co-worker. They told her that they ain't got enough, man, they ain't going to never get rid of paper money. Yeah, people stupid. People stupid. But it's okay. Y'all gonna know sooner or later. Y'all gonna realize that the men of the Lord that's out there on the highways and byways telling y'all certain things was right. Let's go Psalms 36 and 1. A couple of scriptures we get out of here. To the chief musician, a psalm of David, the servant of the, of the Lord. The transgression of the wicked saith within my eye, within my heart that there is no fear of the Most High before his eyes. For he flattereth himself in his own eyes until his inequity be found to be hateful. The words of his mouth are inequity and deceit. He have left off to be wise and to do good. He deviseth mischief upon his bed. He said of himself in a way that is not good. He abhorreth not evil. He loved evil, man. This is this, this Esau, man. E Esau, the so-called white man, got a plan, man. He got a plan with this financial situation. Ain't nothing happening by mistake. It's all a plan, man. It's all a plan. It's all a plan. I did not mean to go there. It's all a plan. It's all a plan by Esau, man. Come on, man. It's all a plan by Esau. He got a plan, but people don't see it, man. Isaiah 32 and 6. For the vile person will speak villainy, and his heart will work inequity. To practice hypocrisy and <laughs> to utter error against the Lord. To make empty the soul of the hungry and he will cause the drink of the thirsty to fail. The instruments also of the churl are evil 
he will he devises wicked devices to destroy the poor with lying words. Isaiah 32 and 7. <laughs> the instruments, <laughs> the instruments also of the chur are evil. He devises wicked devices to destroy the poor with lying words, even when the needy speaketh right. Yeah. This, this is his, man, Esau is not playing. And I seen that, I was like, man, spirit was on me. I, I put the brother, I was watching the brother do Mark a Bass lesson. And, and I put his lesson on pause. So, yeah, you know, you should be jumping back and forth between this brother lesson, this brother, this this camp, this one, this one. And, yeah, and spirit get on you and and, and like Apostle, Elder Apostle of Ramlah say, you got to strike when the iron hot, man. Micah chapter 2, verse 1. Woe to them that divide of inequity and work evil upon their beds. When the morning is light, they practice it because it is in the power of their hand. Yeah, Job 9 and 24. The earth was given into the hand of the wicked. And why is in that why the earth is in the hands of the wicked? They gonna do wicked. <laughs> They gonna do wicked. This is what the wicked gonna do. The wicked is gonna do wicked. Cause that's what they was created to do, man. 13 and 23. That's what the wicked was created to do. Jeremiah 13 and 23. Can the Ethiopian change his skin or the leopard his spots? Then may ye also do good that are accustomed to do evil. No, they can't. This is what they are accustomed to doing. They are accustomed to doing evil. And their money system ain't nothing but evil. And if you put your hope and your trust in it, they gon' they gon' they gonna let you down, man. They gonna let you down, man. Cause they gon' all of the money, all of the money is not gonna be good after a while, man. Second Corinthians two and eleven. Least Satan should get an advantage of us, for we are not ignorant of his devices. Yeah. You can't, you, I mean, hey, man, everybody ain't going to see it, man. The elect, the elect obtained it, the rest was blinded. Let's get this one, Sirach. <laughs> Let's get this one. Ecclesiastes, Sirach, 12 and 10. Never trust thine enemy. Who is our enemy? Esau. Never trust thine enemy, for like as I am rusted, so is his wickedness. Though he humble himself. Oh, it's going to be some goods. It's definitely going to be some beneficial um, things um, associated with. This is how they talk. You know, it's definitely going to be uh, some beneficial uh, things associated with the, uh, you know, with the digital currency and everything. I know, you know, we had to go through some growing pains and, you know, a couple of hiccups here. And, the um, you know, from the transformation from the old system to the new system. This is how they going to hit you with it, man. Why he tug, why, you know, why they on screen tugging at their tie. Trust us. Trust us. It's all going to work out in the end. You know, America is going to be great again. <laughs> Though he humble himself and go crouching, yet take good heed and beware of him, and that thou shalt be unto him as if thou hast wiped the looking glass, and thou shalt know that his rust have not been altogether wiped away. Yeah. You can't trust this guy, man. 13. Who will pity a charmer that is bitten with the serpent? Yeah. He's a snake. Low down dirty snake in the grass, man. Or any such as come nigh wild beasts. Yeah. <laughs> he, you can't, man. You cannot. You cannot trust these guys, man. And this, this financial situation, these banks and all of that, they coming out, they saying one thing in your face, but behind closed doors is a whole nother other situation going on, man. This is the point, man. <clears throat> let's go. Let's go. Ooh. Let's go 13. Proverbs 4 and 13. Take fast hold of instruction. Let her not go, keep her, for she is thy life. <clears throat> Excuse me, Salaki. Enter into 
Enter not into the path of the wicked, and go not in the way of evil men. Avoid it, pass not by it. Turn from it and pass away. For they sleep not, <laughs> listen to this, for they sleep not except they have done mischief, and their sleep is taken away unless they, they cause some to fall. Proverbs 4 and 16. Listen to the scriptures. For they sleep not, except they have done mischief, and their sleep is taken away unless they cause some to fall. Huh? For they eat the bread of wickedness and drink the wine of violence. Yeah. <laughs> Two more. Let's get two more. Let's go Psalms 58 and 3. Smooth as butter. Word, smooth as butter, man. You cannot trust these guys, man. 58 and 3. I went to 53. Scriptures is scriptures is, is right there. It's right there. <clears throat> 58 and 2. Yay. In heart ye work wickedness, ye weigh the violence. Of your hands in the earth. The earth is given into the hands of the wicked. The wicked are estranged from the womb. They go astray as soon as they be born speaking lies. Yeah, that's what they do. They just, they just smoke. They just lie, man. And this financial thing is just one big lie, man. It's just one big lie. It's a big ass Ponzi scheme. But they know they can't come out and tell, you know, the stock markets and all that it crash. They come out and tell you the truth, really, of what's going on. Stock market's going to crash, man. It's going to be pandemonium here. So they're going to come out here, lie, bullshit you, shuck and jive, until they get you where they want you to. Let's go Isaiah 48 and 7. They are created now. And not from the beginning, even before the day when thou heardest them not, least thou shouldest say, Behold, I knew them. Yea, thou heardest not, yea, thou knewest not, yea, from the time that thine ear was not open. For I knew that thou wouldest deal very treacherously, <laughs> and was called a transgressor from the womb. We just read that. Um, from the womb, they go a strange lion. Yeah. For I knew that thou wouldest deal very treacherously and was called a transgressor from the womb. Yeah. As he saw Edom, man. Go astray speaking lies, man. And yeah, so this is come. This, this situation right here is, is, is coming. It's coming. And they to for this to be implemented, more banks gotta go away, man. More banks gotta go away. You see the the um the credit Swiss one is being bought up by somebody else. That's what's gonna happen. All of these banks, they gonna um absorb each other. And then you're gonna end up with a, a few super banks left, and then they gonna it's gonna be ripe for the um to, to implement the digital currency, man. So, yeah, so with that one, we're going to close out all praises, honor, glory to Yahweh, by Hashem, Yahweh Shai, by Hashem, Rukhahakwadash, double honors to the elders, the apostles, the brothers, the men at Great Millstone that rule well, that taught me this truth, to the hopeful elect out there scattered abroad, unlike unto a speckled bird, tabernacle of King David, 144,000 mighty men. Peace, blessings, salutations unto the remnant, men, women, children. Keep your eyes open out there, man. <laughs> Remain spiritual. Quam Yashirah and the Baba Baba. Rock a thumb, family. Shalom.